Hello out there, wherever you are. As for me, I am in Sonoy, Georgia. And we are here to check out, as I'm making my way through rural Georgia to find all these filming locations, I have stumbled across the Alexandria Safe Zone. The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead has been filming in Sonoya for probably about 10 plus years now. They actually just started, stopped filming here in February of this year. And this wall is coming down, um, but it's still here right now. It's outpost number 22. Um, but yeah, that, um, this wall still remains, but this property, property is being redeveloped. So get here while you can, because this is on its way out. But we're here to check out the filming locations for The Walking Dead on Tom Was Here. This is Robert Stack, and when I'm not solving mysteries, I'm watching Tom Was Here. This gazebo they actually used for some Woodbury shots. The governor met Andrea. Oh, yeah. yeah, this gazebo. In the attack on Woodbury, Rick and the group ended up walking right through that gazebo uh, while they were heading towards the main gate to take down the governor. And it was right here. You can see it. Look at that. Yeah, you can go take a seat. And this is actually Woodbury itself. This is the shot. Um, they had a fence that covered the entire Woodbury town line and they were hitting golf balls off of it. Yeah. And you can see that's Woodbury Main Street kind of up there because you can see the water tower placed in the background there. But yeah, downtown Sonoy is actually Woodbury, Georgia. And would you have known that Woodbury, Georgia was so close to Alexandria, Virginia? I bet you wouldn't. But it's right here, and Woodbury's right here. Yes. There was an episode um, from this last season where Eugene um, was talking to the girl on the radio, and she ended up being yeah. basically uh, fake. Yeah. And so he looked right up here at the, what their apartment was. You think she? And was they kidding. showed her kind of standing there, and then she like disappeared. And then he was standing behind this fence here. So at the end of the same episode, when he found out his girlfriend was fake, he went in this alleyway behind the gate and burned his novel, only to have the real girl he talked on the radio walk through the gate behind him. The Commonwealth, and she came in through this gate right here to meet him, like the real girl did, not the other one. And uh, yeah, that was right here, right across from Nick and Norman's, which is Greg Nicotero and Norman Reedus' restaurant they opened here in this town. Now, I don't know what scene or what season, but they definitely used these railroad tracks for something. You can just tell they did. They absolutely used these railroad tracks for sure. And this is Alexandria. The Alexandria safe zone. And these walls are set to come down at some point here. It looks like they are taken down they do have this wall down here, I guess, for an in and out. But when they were filming The Walking Dead, this road, that road over there, this road here, all had a guard gate in front of it, basically blocking it. As you can see, they're turning this into a development. Hey, from the 700s, 700 bucks, I'll buy it. <laughs> no, $700,000. And if you're paying $700,000 for such a thing, uh, wouldn't you want your own zombie proof fence? I, I would, I certainly would, I think. You would want a zombie proof fence, wouldn't you? I think so. Most definitely.
Now you couldn't actually walk down here when they were filming The Walking Dead because like, there was a guard gate letting people in and out. Yeah. But there was a main... I don't know if this was the main gate. I don't think this... I think they used this gate for certain shots. But I don't know if it was exactly the main gate that was used when they all walked in the first time. It might be the gate across the way that we're going to walk over to here. Yeah, you can kind of see a little bit into there. Not much. Not a whole lot. All right. I thank my dad and the boy for journeying me along. We have been all over rural Georgia hunting down movie and TV locations. So thank everybody for coming along. You can see the things they use to kind of prop up the fence there. But they are holding the fence in place. And yes, some of the buildings that they built actually for Alexandria are staying there. And they're going to be properties in this development. Yeah, right where those houses are, the windmill was. Yeah, <laughs> they did tear down the windmill. Yep, there's Norman himself over there on that bike. Yeah, but they did tear down the windmill, so that's gone. But yeah, some of the houses still remain. You can still kind of see some of them. For sure. We're going to head over here to this gate because I think this gate is the Welcome to Alexandria gate, if I remember correctly. It was certainly the one that at one point said, Welcome to Alexandria. And now, if it's still there, I think it says the Commonwealth Outpost. If you're looking at the fence line, if you're coming in from Sonoya Main Street, you're coming in this way, and you're looking at the fence line, here at the end on Lower Creek Trail and Gin Street is what used to say, Welcome to Alexandria. But now currently, as the last time you saw this, they were draping the Commonwealth banner over the front. It used to say welcome to Alexandria up there now it says the Commonwealth outpost 22 they didn't have this on there as far as I can tell from previous seasons so this is a recent ad most likely something you'll see in the last part of the final season here because they didn't just paint that for nothing clearly someone's gonna walk out of there something's gonna come out of there um, but yeah the former Welcome to Alexandria Gate, now taken over by the Commonwealth, Outpost 22. That's really cool that it's still here. They stopped filming here in February. It is the end of June 2022. So at some point, I've heard at some point, this is going to be torn down very soon. So yeah, this gate right here. I believe was the main gate that the survivors walked in because I think it did say welcome to Alexandria. Did it say welcome to Alexandria when they first entered or did they add that? It's been a while since I rewatched The Walking Dead, so you'll have to let me know if they added it or not. They may have added it later, but now it's been taken over by the Commonwealth. Uh, that's really cool that that's still there. That's awesome. I mean, The Walking Dead did good business around here as far as, like, touring and things are concerned. I wonder if they'll lose some of that because they lose the wall. Um, I mean, I, I mean, they still got the Woodbury locations because it's the main drag. They have a few other locations as well. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, the wall, while it's still here, you know, I'm funny. I was watching YouTube videos. And somebody posted one a month ago, and they're like, oh, the wall's coming down within the next couple weeks. The wall's coming down in the next week. And uh, still here at the moment. But it was slated for demolition back in February. And, you know, they said something about maybe early July, of which we're, it's right around the corner, right at the end of next week. So, 
you know, if you see it, this might be the last time. But it's still here currently, and I was glad I was able to see it while it still exists. There you go. And stumbling across the railroad track more like it, but walking there and then. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Do not go to the middle. Don't you go. That was a joke. Sonoy, Georgia. The perfect setting for life. Perhaps afterlife as well. Um, but no, a, uh, you know, I, I called it in the ramp up leading this video, Sonoya, Sonoy, but I heard that locals call it Sonoy, so I'll call it Sonoy here. Um, that's only fair. Um, but yeah, I, my natural Pittsburghese, the way I talk, wants it to say Sonoya, but it's actually Sonoy. Oh. And Nick and Norman's, yep. Checking out the t-shirts and various things available for it. I forgot this annoying has different things that were filmed here on the main street, including driving Miss Daisy. You know, back in my promotional products distributor days, I actually did shot glasses for these people. And you can kind of see, you can see the different stuff that's in here, different outfits yeah. from the show and all types of stuff that's in here. Oh yeah. Yeah, AMC looks like it was displays made possible by the generosity of AMC. Yeah. Very, very cool. Yeah, cool. They have Daryl's crossbow in there, ah, cool. all types of stuff. But yeah, I did shot glasses for them back in the day. Oh yeah? Yeah, in the Woodbury shop. That's cool. So I was hoping it was open to see if I could buy a shot glass that I Helped, uh, yeah, <laughs> help make happen, but another time, Woodbury, another time. Very proper. We're heading out to Noya, finally on our way to Florida after many uh, filming locations. But yeah, the main drag of Woodbury. Alright, let's go. And the water tower, of course. I shoot up that way too. Georgia Tour Company has different. Um, Tours, I'm sure that they were running through uh, Sonoy for a Christmas memory. It'd be worth checking out at some point. Should I ever be back down here, which may or may not happen, probably. <laughs> mm -hmm. So yeah, we were hoping to eat at Nick and Norman's, but it was busy. Um, there was a lot of people in there. It looks like they were taking reservations. Uh, we also. You know, we saw a lot in this video. We got to see my dad beef it on the train tracks. That was awesome. Uh, why is it terrible that my first instinct was to laugh and then my second instinct was to help? But after I laughed, then help? <laughs> what does that say about me as a human or, or the family in which we... Because I feel like if I would have beefed it... I thought it, you were going to say, I can't take him anyway. Yeah. <laughs> well, if I would have beefed it, I think my dad's first instinct would have been to laugh. And roared. then his second instinct would have been to help. But roared. he would have laughed first. I just laughed the And whole then time. help. And this bozo here would have absolutely laughed first. So at least it's a three generation <laughs> of growing up raised on the three stooges, among other things. <laughs> that laughter is, the first. laughter is the first reaction to most things and then help at that point well that'll do it for walking dead filming locations sonoy georgia checking out alexandria and woodbury locations very very cool to see this before it's gone because it's going to be gone soon but Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. If you'd like to support me on Patreon like John Bailey did, you can do so. Link is in the description below. If you'd like to buy a t-shirt, a Tom Was Here t-shirt, you can do so at Spreadshirt, as well as links to my eBay store, Facebook page, Instagram, Clubhouse, and the Pennsylvania Autograph Collectors Association. Links are in the description below. But when it comes to the Walking Dead filming location, I can say that my name is Tom and I was here. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe, bye everyone.